Everybody, it's the Fairy Vibrant Makeup Channel again, and I'm going to be doing um, a trend look. I really wanted to do an ombre lip. I've been wanting to do it, but I just haven't been able to do it. And I wanted to include it in my trend stuff because I've been seeing a lot of it. I've been seeing some really cool ones. Uh, there was this one I saw. She used a like a brownish nude color on her lips, and she dusted on the NYX. Um, Prismatic Colors, the mermaid one, and just here on Cupid's bow and right here in the inner part of her middle lip. Oh my god, it was so pretty. She really did look like it was a kiss from a mermaid. It was so pretty. But I wanted to do my own um, ombre look that I've actually been doing a lot of. I, uh, I like a bold, dark, vampy lip, but I wanted to make it more... Um, lighter so I'm going to show you how to kind of do a dark vampy color with a nude and kind of make an ombre effect to it so let's get started I'm going to zoom in a little closer oops zoom out zoom in is that good enough can you see my lips they're really chapped right now because this winter weather is driving me nuts so I'm going to be using these three products this is the NYX Cosmetics Soft Matte uh, soft matte lip cream in Copenhagen and I've been using um, the lip butter on top of it but I'm going to be using this uh, Maybelline um, nude lip color in cinnamon it's can you see that sin um, sin amon that's what it is but uh, I'm gonna be going over with the uh, lip butter gloss so let's get started I need a mirror so let me grab my mirror so let's go in with the the darker color first. I'm going to be going on the um, outer portion of the lip. Let's start with my Cupid's bow. So basically just drawing that line. crisp as possible. I know a lot of people use like a lip liner but I wanted to use this because I love this color. Okay, so there's the, the dark color. Now let's go in with the nude color, which this is the color, it's cinnamon. And then just go in the inner portion. Like so. And I'm just gonna keep wiping it off with a makeup wipe so that I can take off that excess uh, color that gets stuck to the nude lipstick. Alright, I'm going to go in with my lip butter from NYX Cosmetics. And this is the uh, Madeline, I believe. I'm going to go over the nude color and then just press my lips together and then just touch up any uh, parts that need touching up. I know it looks a little bit more ombre on the bottom lip than the top, but that happens. So there we 
go. There's the ombre lip that I wanted to create. Let's zoom you out. Oops. I'm still trying to get used to this. <laughs> Does it want to zoom out? There we go. Okay, so that's the ombre lip that I wanted to create. It. It's a uh, a vampy color and also nude it's uh, fun it's 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 I think it's sexy so if you do like these trend things I'm gonna be doing them um, every Wednesday of um, you know the month I'm this this one's gonna be posted in end of February but the uh, the next ones are actually going to be spring related they're gonna be um, I'm gonna be doing one every Wednesday and they're going to be pastel colors on the lid. So I'm going to be doing uh, pastel eyeshadows along with a complimentary lip. Something that complements the eye. So a lot of people don't like wearing um, pastel eyeshadows because they tend to look like they wash you out. But I'm going to create one that will add some, you know, that will look good with any skin color, especially dark skin colors because they have the most beautiful skin and they ha they can pull off those pastel colors a lot and even fair skins can pull off those colors as well I'm gonna be making them so that any color you are any shade you are light medium dark olive like myself um, you'll be able to pull that off so I wanted to create uh, some pastel eyes that anybody can pull off so I hope you enjoyed this I'm gonna be doing these once a month once a month. That was my other one. I'm going to be doing these um, every Wednesday of the month and I'm going to just try and stay on top of all the trends in the makeup world. So I hope you guys enjoyed this and also watch the tutorial on this eye um, soon. Okay, so uh, I hope you guys enjoy this. Uh, actually, it will be posted on Friday. So on Friday, stay tuned for this tutorial on this eye. And I hope you guys enjoyed this. I hope you guys enjoy my channel. If you have any other suggestions that you would like to see on my channel, please let me know. I will be able to do whatever you want. Um, and uh, I want to get creative. So let's do this. So I hope you guys enjoyed this and stay vibrant.